Hey everybody, I'm David and today I want to talk about some breaking news that uh, was reported by Deadline today. Apparently a Supergirl movie is now in development over at Warner Brothers. Uh, 22 Jump Street screenwriter uh, Oren Uzel is going to be penning the script, I guess. And um, look, this is like any other DC movie news I hear. Uh, whenever I hear a new film is in development, um, it's like, okay, so when are you guys going to focus on the characters you already have that you haven't really done justice with yet, except for maybe one, Wonder Woman, right? Uh, look, I want another Man of Steel movie. I want to see Superman with his full potential. I want to see a Batman movie with Ben Affleck or whoever the hell is going to be playing Batman. I want to see a Green Lantern movie. I want to see a Flash movie. Maybe even a Cyborg movie. Um, all these spin-offs, I'm like, oh, okay, but you guys aren't focusing on the characters that matter. Uh, you're giving us a Birds of Prey film. You're giving us Shazam. Okay, it could be cool. Um, you, could, you know, I, I just want to know what the plan is with all these characters. Are they just... Let's throw this character out there, and then this character, and then let's say you want to make a sequel for that character. And your timetable is all filled up. Are we going to have to wait 20 years for Supergirl 2 or something like that? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm getting frustrated about? It's how they're just throwing everything out there, and we don't know where all of this is going. Now... Why don't we get a Superman movie first with Supergirl in the Superman film? And then if Superman 2 does well with Supergirl in it, why don't we get a Supergirl spinoff from that? Wouldn't that be a more, a better idea? I don't know. Uh, look, I'll be excited for it once it comes out. Of course I'll be going to see it. I, I've seen almost every superhero movie that has come out in theaters anything that has marvel or dc labeled on it you can bet your ass i'm gonna go support it because i want to see these characters be brought to life and be done justice i seen justice league twice despite the fact that i was kind of disappointed by it um i'm just frustrated when i hear spontaneous uh reports that have nothing to do with the characters that should be given the the attention that they need. I wish they would look at what Marvel is doing. I'm not saying be like Marvel, the tone or stuff like that. Be your own movie. But I don't know. I just want to see a Superman 2 before I see a Supergirl movie. That's That's the way I'm looking at it. And I'm sure there's many other fans that feel the same way as I do. You know, whenever news about DC comes out, something like this, I do get frustrated. And I know there's other fans that get frustrated too. So I want you guys to leave down your comments below and tell me how frustrated you feel as well. Or are you someone that says, you know what, David, let it go. Let DC explore these characters and see which ones are. Maybe they have to see where their strengths are by doing something like this. And hey, if it stalls Superman 2 or Man of Steel 2, whatever it is, then so be it. As long as we're getting good movies with whatever this is that they're doing. So, I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm overreacting as usual. Or maybe people agree with me. Who knows? Um, there was some news about Birds of Prey also that I, I didn't read the full article. But apparently Black Mask uh, might be in the Margot Robbie Birds of Prey f movie that's cool i guess at least i know that one's going to be connected for sure to the dceu and at least margot robbie was in suicide squad so we know where her character is going to end up um whether it's suicide squad 2 or birds of prey i don't care as long as we know where some of these characters are going to pop up once in a while uh so i don't know with that being said i hope you guys comment below tell me your thoughts I hope you guys like this video. If you agree with me, like it even if you don't agree with me. It's it's uncool to dislike videos. Uh, and with that being said, until next time, take care.